this video we'll see how to install the Raspberry Pi P audio drive sound card and hard drive in Raspberry Pi 5 so you take your Raspberry Pi 5 you try to lift the brown part on your Raspberry Pi 5 and you insert the connector like this with a stripe here on the right okay you slide it in and you push in it should be inserted just to check here it should be perfectly aligned okay then step number two you, if you have the official case you could insert your Raspberry Pi then you take yeah right you take the white part here like this oh maybe the other way around like this okay you're good then you take the Raspberry Pi P audio drive hat and you lift this connector here and you put it inside like this once again you should be perfectly parallel okay if you want to check now this should be perfectly parallel and actually it's not so let's try to do it again okay yeah, this is better so now you need to insert the hat so you need to be perfectly inserted and parallel again and you push it in uh, okay should be all set so from there you could pull up your device using the usual USB-C port right now I have a SD card already installed uh, and you'll see the green light another option and this is actually the recommended option you could use the USB-C port on the device the advantage of it is that you could use any USB-C power delivery supply including like laptop power supply um, or anything with like um, poor delivery uh, profiles so if you see if you use the USB-C plug here you'd still need to push on the button to start the device and this is not the case if you're using this port so it's important to know so for now we'll turn it off and now I will show you how to install so I will show you how to install a MVNE drive so be sure you're off and not plugged you insert the drive like this so and if you chose to use like a long drive like this one you you will need to use a screw which is located on the side to firmly attach your device um, then to enable the MVNE drive in your system please follow the other tutorial 
This tutorial is just about the physical aspect of it. You could also use a smaller cute drive like this. And this way you need to use the other hole here. You will find in the technical description all tested drives and also drives that has, have not been tested but should work. Thank you.